All right, ladies and gentlemen, what is up? Welcome to our 13th match, uh, round two of the loser's bracket for this uh, FFT AI tournament in the fall of 2019. That's right. So on top, we have Super Devon and his team. And then on bottom, it has uh, Miri's and my team. Uh, the team names for Super Devon, once again, are a team of status and ice. And then for Miri's team and mine, it's based off of the name of her cell phone, I guess. It's uh, Diabolical. Diabolical Rotting Fungus Sublimination. A little hard to say that sometimes. So let's uh, introduce the units then, shall we? Let's get right to it. We have Fianna the Thief, Ingram the Lancer, Suzanne the Geomancer, and Chips the Oracle. And now for um, Mirai's team and my team, we have Kermit Smash the Knight, and fuck you Xbox One, turn it on randomly. Uh, RNG Roulette the Monk, Bloody Annoyance, the Red Chocobo, and Sticks Break Bones, the Oracle. So, took a little quick look one or two minutes before I hit record. The Oracle having can uh, being a Capricorn, the Knight being a Cancer, they all have bad compatibility with this Thief, this Geomancer, and this Oracle. So there's a lot of bad compat overall. In addition to those uh, compatibilities, the Monk being a Virgil, she's got bad compat with uh, this Lancer, a Gemini. Um, uh, the, the red chocobo is the only one who has neutral compat with everybody on the team. So assuming no damage splits go off from this, uh, Geomancer, he, the red chocobo can two shot, um, anyone but the Lancer. And because the monk and the Lancer have bad compat, the charms are going to be a little bit more of a pain in the ass to trigger. So, oh uh, yeah, let's get right to it then. Um, so the maps we're going to go to are in map number 39. Underground Passage in Goland. So this is where you uh, save Reese in the optional missions and you have Beowulf being the slow turtle that he is. Um, interesting. Uh, looks like the orc or the chocobo kind of being closest to the corner means he's probably not going to get as far, far away from the team as others. Uh, yeah, let's just see how this uh, goes. Um, he does have a lot of height though. So does the orc, uh, the monk, she's right behind him. All right, not bad. Everybody's just going to inch for it bit by bit, and we'll see uh, how things transpire once, uh, probably, uh, the Thief's going to move, and I think the, the Chocobo's going to be in range, yeah, he's doing it from a fair distance, see, that's the 150 damage I was talking about, and Blade Grasp is not going to bypass that, so that's more than half of the Oracle's life bar, so, not bad item through item, but CT was wasted to heal up that HP, are there any Petrifies here? Now that looks like an uh, ice spell. That's what it looks like. Um, looks like a double panel ice spell, because it was charged on her originally. And wow, three people are... Wow, they're all clustered right there. 55% chance of charm, too. That is really bad. Oh, that is, that is really, really, really bad. Confusion Song? It does not hit, thankfully. Uh, I'm not sure what this... This does not look good. Yeah, wow. Took more than the majority of her life bar away. Holy hell. Charm under the Oracle, which is nice, but uh, complete boy, Ch fishing for kills. A little bit too bad that Red Chocobo is just going to wreck havoc in my own team with that charm. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit too bad right now. Uh, the charm really was important, but another confusion. Now, Steel Helmet, nope, does not work. Cure 4. At least she's alive, which is nice. Um... Damage Split should... No, Damage Split did not trigger that time. That is really bad. Really bad that uh, Damage Split didn't trigger. Because, uh... Um, it could have broken the Chocobo out of Charm, and it doesn't. So, Instant Paralyze is a response. And so now he can't really do anything. Um, any Charms? Bag Smack, yeah. But he's... It's, it's one unit down, and the other unit is, uh... A little too far up. So, any Sleeps? Uh, it does go occur on the Chocobo. It's a little bit too bad. So, I can't remember if he's got... Yeah, he's got Charm. 90... Wow, Triple Panel Don't Act. I wonder if it's going to go off. I want to see a Triple Panel Don't Act, please. Yes. It's actually kind of nice. How many does it hit? Two out of three. That's really devastating right there. Um, it's probably going to be an Asuna. Yeah, it's going to get rid of the Sleep and the Don't Act. She stole some armor, which is pretty important. Uh... I believe she stole the helmet. The Chocobo's ready to go, and he's ready to kick some ass. 
All right, killing him is very important. Um, she blocked. She died. Or she, well, she blocked it once again with blade grass. A little too bad. The item bot can't revive at all. Uh, double panel heal. Heal on the thief isn't really going to do much. She's just kind of like more of a status bot. So, 140 ice. Another ice too. Speed save? No, speed save does not trigger. The red choker was probably dead here. Yeah, it's a little bit too bad, but a little bit of revival should do the trick. Yeah. He's back in action, and then she should be in the range for a cure, too. Yeah, 100%. Uh, 100% at race, too. Not bad, not bad. So my team's kind of recuperating a little bit, but this Geomancer is just kind of free casting at the moment. Yeah, she's kind of free casting. Damage split, any speed saves? Yeah, it's nice, nice. So the longer it goes on, the be more my monk will benefit from it. Uh, regen, yeah. So she's got regen and move HP up. The, the, yeah, the thief was being a little bit terrorizing because she was just constantly putting people down or something. Uh, damage split. He's, he's dead because of the damage split. That's too bad. Um, he chose not to resurrect them, which is kind of interesting. Uh, another race two should go off here. 75%. Decent odds. Frog, 20%. That does not seem like a wise choice. We'll see if it goes off, though. Same with the race, too, which is not bad. Pretty good. Pretty good odds. Uh, is it going for another... No. Sleep proc? Ah, uh, a double sleep proc. Are you shitting? Wow, there's like a 20% chance of that triggering. She gets a double sleep. That's perfect for stigma magic right there, though. Thankfully, they're in position like that, but still... That, the odds of that occurring are very slim. They're extremely slim for that to occur. Um, Lancer has not resurrected the... He has not resurrected the Oracle yet. He's been ignoring him the entire time, which I find very fascinating. Um, it's really strange for them to do that. And two 34% sleeps. Oh my gosh, wow. This RNG, man, is it's just killing. Three sleeps in a row? Are you shitting me? Oh my god. That's three sleeps in a row. What is, what is the probability of that? Oh my god. Those odds are so slim to occur. This is like a 19% for the, the proc. And then the sleeps were like a 30% and they got every one of them. Wow. That, that was absolutely insane right there. Oracle's keeping everything alive, but if, if I end up losing, it's going to be because of the these 30%. <laughs> Yeah, they're getting tired of Professor Derevan's lessons. Uh, it's still a three on four. I think I could still pull this back, though, because speed save monk. Um, that's what I needed. And she dodged two 75%. Oh, that luck, man. It is, uh, it's really paying off. She's getting very lucky. Insanely lucky, in fact. Oh, my God. Yeah, th there's an insane amount of luck going on right now. It's the RNG gods, man. They're, uh... They're insulting me. Even though it's a permanent 3 on 4, I've just been on the back foot ever since all of those sleeps hit. Oh, and it's not good. Um, she's probably going to go down to a bag smack, even with all this points of speed save. Chakra, not bad. 90 plus 30, 120. 157 HP heal. And she's getting stripped naked. Ah, oh, this is not good. And I believe, is she going to go for a charm? 28%, that's huge. Oh my god, that is huge right there. Oh, his weapon being stolen. They broke her out of the bag smack, not good. Is she dead though? Yeah, this is uh, this is looking really bad. Um, Complete Boy's got to get a turn in, and the Choco's got to get up. Yeah, the Oracle is kind of keeping everything at bay. Oh, 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 now you, now you don't want to hit when it matters. Okay, I see how it is. <laughs> no accessory, oh my gosh. This is actually kind of close. Closer than I want it to be, but th those those sleeps clinched it. I think um, anything gonna get stolen here. Punch! Wow, 144, not 144 damage. Not bad. Chocoball will be a mid charge, right? Yep, yep. Damage split though. Okay. Ice two. Ah, oh, damn. She guarded the spell. Another point of speed save. Okay. What's she at? She's naked now. She has no armor in her kit. That is a little bit. Ooh, this is uh. She's kind of dangerous. She's like a ninja now, but without any armor. Oh, man. It's really up to her, but I don't know if it's going to happen. Let's see. All right, she's dead, thankfully. She's getting a lot of turns in. Any charms? Yes, and he does have items, so he could bring people up. Oh, my gosh. I might be able to pull this off. Wow, she has been com stripped completely naked. This, uh, this, uh, 
uh, this uh, this monk. She has no she has nothing, literally. <laughs> it's a naked monk. She's uh, she's flaunting her body off. Oh, that that. Oh my gosh. I want to know how. I want. What I'm curious. I want to know how fast this monk is because I th I bet all the points of speed she's acquired is what allowed her to win. I I think it, this is over because it's a permanent uh, 4v3. Let me just take a look. Well, that that explains it. 17 speed. Yeah. Good luck fucking killing her. <laughs> if she did die, though, it would be kind of game over. 58%, even though it's bad compat, do remember, the evasion is not accounted for. And she's got a ton of speed. And the more speed you have, the more effective your chances are of hitting uh, uh, the steel spells, because they factor in speed as well. So, yeah, wow, that was a crazy round. Those, those, uh, goddamn, those uh, sleeps had me on edge there. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, let's go to our uh, second round. I want to see something just as eventful. Hopefully we don't get three 30% sleeps in a row. We'll see. Alright, welcome back. Entrance to Death City. Uh, yeah, the place where Rafael, the little teleporter that he destroys after you uh, beat him in the final set of missions. So, charm right off the bat. Okay. Pretty small map, like I said before. Um... Uh, kind of interesting because with the map being so with there being just like one area like this the red chocobos can be do a lot of targeting the ray spells are not going to be really fact the height is not going to be factored for like all the spells being casted um I'm not sure what he's going for a confusion song double point don't act all right what do we get one don't act ice two all right damage split nice nice any speed saves nah that's too bad all right, so it does hit her, which is a little unfortunate. She moved back into range, kind of dumb. Helmet stolen, not good, not good. Ooh, that's a little bit too bad for my team. Uh, blade grasp, so the Lancer could probably just go for a... Oh wait, frog? 50%, remember, no evasion. It could hit, and it'll be on an item user. Any petrifies, though. Ah, uh, damn. But I think he's still charging, so I don't think it's going to cancel the spell once he gets uh, Asuna. I think he'll still be charging the spell. Let me see if I'm correct on that assumption. No, it's cancelled. Ah, oh, that that's unfortunate. And wow, she's just being stripped naked by this lesbian over here. What the hell? He's dead as a choke of meteor. That's not good. And remember, the item user is paralyzed. Oh, stop? Oh, that's too bad. Okay, I wasn't sure. A little bit lucky there on my, uh, on my night's end with uh, getting past all the uh, evasion. So, um... A poker to death? Nope, nope, Dragon Spirit. Okay. She's trying to steal, she's trying to pillage what she can before she's sentenced to death. Um, Choker was just doing his thing, sniping people. And every time that uh, Lancer does something, every time that Lancer does something, that Choker was going to put someone right back down in their place. So I think our team is going to pull this off against Super Devon. Unless a charm from that far away can do something. We'll see. No weapon breaks, thankfully. Okay. It's too bad that uh, the Chocobo couldn't get a turn in, but it's okay. And she's petrified, so is someone dead? I kind of forget. No, the monk is still alive. So the monk can still use stigma magic on the oracle, but she has to get up there, like, instantly. Um, any charms, though? Nah, getting some lucky charms. Let's see. Stigma magic, right? Yeah, yeah. Nice, nice. Okay. Chocobo's still doing his thing. Putting people down. Not bad. <clears throat> okay. She's mid-charging. Only her weapon was broken. The weapon, the Goku rod, not that big of a deal. It just means no melee. Um, at least they're full health, but another ice... Remember, she has uh, she has the white robe, so that's why she broke out of it so quickly. Damage split? Yep. Okay. I think I kind of have this in the bag. The I'm just waiting for the charm to wear off. It hasn't worn off yet. Any accessories stolen? No, that's too bad. All right. Well, I can get behind the don't act on the night because at least he's not doing anything that's annoying. Um, and the charm's just gonna wear off faster. It's on this Geomancer, the tag team in the, the Chocobo. I think he's dead after this jump. Yeah. 
That's that's fine though because of revival and uh, the heal the heal spells can come into play here. Let's see if I'm right. Uh, nope, Lancer's gonna get a turn. Put him right back down. Okay. Well, at least the monk is healed up fully. Uh, this Geomancer's just been kind of running rampant, doing whatever the hell she wants with the ice spells. Any uh, revival? Nice, nice. Yes. The, the Geomancer has just been ignored this entire uh, round, which is a little bit unfortunate on my end. Finally, the Don't Act all the status wears off. Um, they're kind of hanging in there as long as they can. Luckily, there's no uh, Petrifies that have been triggering, so that's kind of nice. Only half a, only half damage from the first shot. That's one advantage two swords has over two hands, is that uh, you only take half damage from with damage split from the first shot. So that's kind of interesting. Redirected the spell. Nice, she's guarded though, which is not smart of her, with the Aegis Shield, I believe. Um, that poor Chocobo, he just keeps on getting... Uh, he keeps on just getting his uh, Nuggets attacked. He might have some... Uh, Poorly reproduced children. All right. Well, it's just the uh, Lancer now. I think our team's got this in the bag, Mire. Because uh, I don't think this Lancer can do it. Yeah, it's a permanent two v four. Yeah, that first round was pretty interesting. Um, the charm coming into play was nice. Forty four percent, even bad from Pat. That's okay. Um, any weapon breaks? No, but that's okay. All right. All right, well, uh, Super Divan, congratulations. You made it this far in the tournament. Um, you put on a good showing, uh, especially for that first round and throughout the tournament in general. I'm um, Yuri. Our team is uh, progressing forwards. Um, I think, well, you know what? Since we're doing this live and I do it after the recordings, let's just do it at the same time. Let's go to the display capture. So it was a 2-0 sweep. Um, why do I, oh, I need to pull the browser up. I'm being stupid. Okay, with that, yeah, whoever loses 16, it's going to be Rockstar or we might get a rematch against uh, Oglog the Frog. That's interesting. Okay, so Super Divine was 0, and we were at 2. Okie doke. Alright, well, with that said then, guys and gals, um, we're going to move on to our next match then. I will see you guys for that uh, tomorrow for the next set of batches, or the next batch of videos that I'll in. uh I'll be streaming and uh, recording. So, yeah. Uh, thanks for stopping by, and I'll talk to everybody um, tomorrow then. Uh, yeah, take care until then. Bye-bye.